Hey guys, how's it going? I hope you're having a great day. Today we're going to be opening up these three booster packs of Twilight Masquerade. This is the first three booster packs for the channel. I'm getting excited, as I'm interested to see what sort of cards I'll get from this set. This is still a relatively new set, which means that I should technically have better chances at getting rare cards. That's just my theory and based on past experiences. Before we get started though, please consider leaving a like, subscribe to the channel to support us, and feel free to leave comments below for the analytics. Okay, let's get into it. Okay, just opening the first one up, let's see. Man, this is exciting. I wonder what I'll get for this first pack. Just taking this out carefully. Okay, here we go. First up we have a Flay Bay Bay, cool. Then we have Timber, Strong Timber. Then we have Aaron, very docile. And then Spinarak, laying low there. Then Tatsugiri, cool ability. Farigaraf, all right, all right. Then Jamming Tower, nice. Then Reverse Hole Molga, that's also nice. And then we have a Blood Moon Ursa Luna EX. Wow, for the love of Arceus. I can't believe it. Oh my Dark Rai. It's a bit heavy on the right side border, but that's okay, I'll still take it. The back looks symmetrical though. Amazing stuff. Man, oh man. Wow. Then we've got the Heat Tran, a Fire Energy card, and the Code card. Pretty good for the first booster pack. I love it. Okay. Setting these cards aside carefully. We don't want to damage them, especially that nice gold car. Okay, opening up the second one. Man, I still can't believe it, I pulled that car. I'm still on a high, feeling great. All right, let's open this one up carefully. I don't think I'll get a rare one out of this, but yeah, let's just see anyway. Okay, so first up, it looks like we have a Chinchar, just adjusting the cards there. And then we have a Whirly Pete, cool. And then a Crawdaunt under a waterfall. And a far-fetched, very nice. And then we've got a lucky helmet. This looks pretty useful. This may work very well with Tinkaton. Cool. Then we have a mighty Yina. That's all right then. A revive room, cool too. And a reverse hollow Heracross, nice. And a reverse hollow Sandy Gas, that's cool too. Then finally, an Alakazam non EX hollow, very cool. Then we have a basic lightning energy and the code card. As I expected, coming from a high, you're bound to go down low, but I'm still pretty happy. Seeing some of the other cards are still pretty cool. That Alakazam card is still amazing. Just remembering its moves, there might be a combo that you can pull off there. But anyway, gotta move on. Let's check what the third pack has for us. Hopefully some nice EX cards or alt art. Okay. Okay, first we have what looks like Sand Shrew, cozying in the rocks. Cool. Then. Darumaka, Spitting Fire. Very nice art. Then, Eye Palm, Cool Shot. And then, Poliwag, Staring on Water. And then, Iglesion, It Looks Very Happy. And then, we have the Diplin with a cool ability. Festival Lead, Hasn't Taken Off But Still Cool. And, Kilowatt Trail. Then, a Reverse Hollow Caretaker. Nice. And then, the same Poliwag in Reverse Hollow. And last, Hisuyan, Arcanine Hollow with the basic psychic energy and the code card. That's not bad at all. I'm pretty happy with this overall. We didn't get any alt arts, but I'm still happy with the hyper rare, but yeah. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and comment. They are very much appreciated. Have a great day or night wherever you are in the world and take care.